Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Aurora Plays Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. I'm your humble bard, Tim. The previous session, we started this game. We got mugged by some thieves and we rocked up in Baldur's Gate. And coming to the Elf Song Tavern, we descended into the sewers to kill some rats. And then we found a bunch of kobolds and we killed the shit out of them, as well as some bugbears. Finding that the person that had um, given us the key to get down here had a different way. We could have gone down these stairs and he got himself captured. And so we had to rescue him. And now we're going to be heading further on into this. Down to level two of the sewers. There we go. Ooh, a keen short sword. Yes, please. Because keen weapons give you additional ability to crit. And it's actually better than my... Uh, my long sword anyway, because my long sword is a bit rusty. Ah, oh, man. All right, I... I'll save it again. I'm going to... Recall back up here. Uh, if you get need something leather to armor. Skull or a helm to protect your own, you come to the right place. Like, I'm honestly not sure what the armor does, when perfectly honest. If quality and price are your chief concerns, then look no farther. You'll find my shop has excellent weapons at reasonable prices. But let's purchase ourselves some nice leather. Oh, friend. I think the smell of the... Quite frankly, I don't think I like the look. That's a really disturbing <laughs> image. I think I prefer... <laughs> I prefer the, the, the link tunic to that. Good God. Can't you just wear the green and put the armor over the top of it? It looks ridiculous. That's no better. Alright, fine. Let's see if anyone has any more missions for us. Thank you for finding Ethan. Oh yes, he told of course. Me what happened down in the sewers. Yes, he was an asshole. Here's some coins for your trouble, and please, you're welcome to rest here any time, no charge. I appreciate the hospitality. Ah, nice. This guy's still sleeping. Yeah. Oh. Please. Leave me be. I want no trouble. You're right. I, I've been waiting for someone, but I fear I wait in vain. And who have you been waiting for? My man, Kissin. Yeah. Had just gone on an it's gonna be kissing her man. expedition into the north to a place called Battle of the Bones, where the dead still walk. He has a talent for the shadowy arts, and he had been asked to recover an item, an orb for someone, then bring it here to Baldur's Gate. The amount of money he was being offered was more than either of us had ever seen. I see. When I spoke to him about the expedition, however, he was acting strangely. Almost dazed, as if he'd been hypnotized or charmed. He was obsessed with finding this orb for his new employer. We had agreed to meet here in the Elf Song should anything happen. But it's been almost three nights now. And I have seen no sign of him. I fear for the worst. I fear that the orb he recovered may have done something horrible to him. Well, if I'll see, if I see this man, I will let you know. And Ipswich. Well met, friend. It's good to see a new face in the Elf Song. Please have a seat, share a drink. Uh, my name's Ipswich. And what brings you to Baldur's Gate? I was mugged. 
Okay, apparently I thought to seek my fortune here, but, uh, yeah, I got mugged instead. Ah, oh, sad tale, friend. My heart goes out to you. It seems Baldur's Gate has not been treating its visitors well of late. I, too, am a stranger here. So why did you come here? Well, I came to pay my respects at the Shrine of Suffering, the local temple run by the priests of Ilmatter. Mm hmm But I came to find the temple sealed, and no one answered my summons. I had a terrible feeling that something was wrong inside, but I did not know what. Well, yeah. The Temple of Ilmatar's always got stuff bad going on because they're a bunch of BDSM freaks. So why do you wish to visit the shrine? <sighs> my brother's bones lie within the crypts beneath the shrine. I'd hoped to pay my respects at his grave and take back with me his medallion that had been buried with him. Yeah. It was always his intention that it be passed on through our family, and now that I have a little one of my own, I wish my child to have the medallion. But now I do not know what to do, so I sit here, drink, and wait for the shrine to awake. Well, if I can get into the shrine, I'll raid your brother's tomb and keep the medallion for myself. All right. Thanks for the rescue down in the sewers, friend. I feel like a right fool for not heeding my own advice and staying clear of that place. Here are a few coins as a way of thanks. I'm an old trinket of mine from my younger days. It's not much, but it may be of use to you. Thank you. Did you find that thief who was running around in the sewers? No, no, I'll find him later. Ah, Amulet of Dexterity. Fucking ow! Alright, let's try that again. miss with every single one of those shots. I don't have the energy. <laughs> Fuck off, leave me alone. This cube, fuck off! It's a spitting cube. Oh god! No! Go away! Thought of a gelatinous cube making this noise. mistake.
Get off! No! Oh shit, this is a mistake. A fine dagger. Hey, dagger, you're so fine. You're so fine. You stabbed my friends. Hey, Nikki. No, a dagger, not a Mickey. <laughs> Why is that a save point? Why is there such a, a save point so close? Oh my god, that's a fast moving ooze. Well, that's a lot of slime. Deeply concerned about the sewers underneath Boulder's Gate.
Leather boots plus one. Yes, please. Uh, armor 29, base attack 6 damage. Alright. I don't know what any of these things really mean. If I'm level 3 with an AC of 29, I should be basically immortal. Plus one level, little boots. We have many fine deals. Swords, axes, bows. We have everything you need right here. If you need something to split someone's skull, or a helm to protect your own. You come to the right place. That's kind if of what quality I want and me. price are your chief concerns, then look no farther. You'll find my shop has excellent weapons at reasonable prices. Oh, friend. I think the smell of the sewers has taken a liking to you. We have many fine deals. No farther. You'll find my shop has excellent weapons at reasonable prices. All right. God damn it. Damn it.
I don't have the energy. Finally. When's the mimic gonna show up and just completely ruin my fucking day? So we're finally at level... Oh, we're at the crypt. Fantastic. Well, I know this has been absolutely thrilling to watch, but, um... Yeah, I think we're going to end it there. Honestly, I don't know whether I'm going to continue with this, because this is really just... Like, there's nothing really to say about it. You're just sort of wandering around in dead silence, swinging your sword. At least with the, like, Dark Alliance, um with Drist and everything like that, the combats were at least interesting to look at. With this, you just got the one attack, and then your, your ranged attack with the spells, so... Anyway, we'll see how I'm feeling later on, but uh, for now, that's where we're going to leave it. So, thank you all very much for watching. Uh, please remember to like and subscribe. I have been your humble bard, Tim, and... I guess be sure to come back for the next session of Aurora Plays. It might be Dark Alliance, Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance, but it may not be. But, uh, yeah, for now. <laughs>